Hi everyone, welcome back. Last week we changed the batteries in a uninterruptible power supply. That one took three. And when it rains, it pours. It's raining outside. This one is dead. And I'll show, let you know how I figured that out. And we're going to change the battery in this. So. <laughs> As you can see, green light's on, the lamp's on, and it's plugged in back here. So, and then when I unplug it, it goes to the battery. It's going to start beeping. Now, this lamp does not pull that much power. It's um, an energy, energy efficient bulb. So this should keep this on for hours because it's the only thing plugged into it. It's already depleting. And it's still dying. And that was it. That was all the power left in that battery. So now we determined that the battery is bad. What we need to do is take those two screws out. And this is a um, a watch. It's a Minute Man from Para. Minute Man from Para Systems. It's an Entrust Series ETR 700. In this one, you uh, unscrew this. That screw. Unscrew. at the bottom there now this cover should slide down slides down comes off that exposes our battery it has this nice little piece of tape there and you can see Positives over here, positives over here on the left, negatives over here on the right. This battery is a first power. It's a 12 volts, 7 amp hour battery. Well, 7 amp hour. Seven amp hour just isn't enough. We're going to give it 9 amp power. So all that means is that when the power goes out, it's going to, the battery has more power in it. So what we need to do is unplug the positive, unplug the negative on our battery. Take off the caps on the new battery and simply plug it in because they're all standard make sure it's secured positive and plugged in and secured or the negative. <clears throat> now we can take a little piece of tape off, put on this battery. Now just slide it up in place. So now, see our the battery fits just fine. Lay it flat. case back on and put our two screws back in and 
And that's the thing about uninterruptible power supplies is they're running batteries. So uh, batteries go bad over time. No sense in taking this thing. It's perfectly good. It works great. It's fine. Why chuck it and go buy a new one? Just uh, go online, get a replacement battery, couple screws, pull the cover off, put the, you know, hook the positive the positive, the negative the negative, and put it back in, put the cover back on, you're good to go. So let's plug it in. It's going to run through a self-test. Now this battery does have a charge on it, but it's not much of one. So it'll take some time, and it will ch the uh, uninterruptible power supply will charge up this battery. Okay, and again, we just have the uh, lamp plugged in and plugged into the uninterruptible power supply. And it lasted less than a minute before. It's plugged in now. I'm gonna turn it on. Let's turn on the lamp. There it goes. Now I'm going to unplug it. And now it's running on battery power. Now before, it didn't even last a minute. I'm not going to leave this on for hours for you guys to see that it's working. But you can hear the beeping is a lot louder now. which that would get annoying. See, working, running just fine. So, like I say, batteries go bad over time. You just gotta change the battery in here. Generally, they're very easily, very easy to replace. I'm plugging this back in. Because it's already past, it should be past the point. But you get the idea. The battery light still on, solid, so it's got enough charge. Batteries go bad, they just don't keep their charge. Just replace the battery, and the unit will be working fine and great, just like it did before. Hey Thanks everyone, if you like that video, you know what to do. Hit that like button, get subscribed down below. If you have any questions or anything, Leave a comment down below. I will monitor it and answer any questions that I can for you. Uninterruptible power supply is, can be a lifesaver. It's a wonderful thing to have, especially with computers. You know, you're working on a Word document. You get to the fifth page. You save. You get to the tenth page. Power goes out. You lost at least five of your pages. Uninterruptible power supply, it's going to let you know, hey, power is out. Start sh saving, start shutting everything down. It can really save you from having to do additional work. The batteries do go bad over time. It's a simple matter to replace the battery and then it's up working and functional again. And there's no sense in, in throwing this away and getting a new one when you just need to change the battery in it. Don't forget though, recycle your old batteries. And we'll see you guys in the next one.